Let's see what we got here. Woo! Let's start off with the chairs here. What's up, Kenny? What's up, girl? How you hey. doing? You see took the you time got? out in this damn heat to come to see if I'm okay? Of course, Kenny. That's why I love you, home girl. You really oh, do boy. care about me. You like them chairs? Yeah. You know, if you fix them up. How much you think? Ten bucks a piece. Ooh. Oh, I don't know nothing about this vintage stuff, right, Chip? I think it's Victorian style. They did a lot of, you know, wood carvings with like floral design. Oh, look what it said. Made in Italy. Oh, yeah, that's snazzy. I'm glad Mary's here. <laughs> Cause I don't know nothing about this here fancy furniture. So what do you think, Mayor? I got the chair, the couch, and a love seat. I mean, if it's all there, I'll probably get up to a thousand bucks for this set. That's why I love you, Southern girl. Totally. My homie forever. Yeah, and I'd love to stay, but I gotta go escape my own locker. All right. Wish me luck. Peace in the Middle East. <laughs> nice shirt. And this stuff right in here, probably give 50 bucks. Go that way and bold. Let's see about. $50 worth of stuff in here. Look at that, nice. I got three boxes. I'll probably go like $50 a box right here. What's this? Some cowboy shit. Right here, I don't know what this is, but it might be worth something. I'll put it to the side. Hey, look at this. It's like something they see on some gun smoke. Hmm. Some hats. We got the hat and we got the boots. Nice little cowboy right here. Nice little gun holster. But this thing look real leather. This old cowboy stuff might be worth some bucks. Giddy up. <laughs> nice little stove here. I see about a good hundred bucks right here. Refrigerator. Clean, look at that boy. I see about $75 for the refrigerator. We got a nice little television on. A Samsung, 25 bucks. Got a nice little dinette cabinet back here. Look like in good condition. Probably say about 150 bucks for that. Got a nice magic carpet. Two of these, probably about $50 a piece. Crusty flush mattress, like Mary said. Nobody want that. Oh my God. I'm gonna take my old fans cowboy gear and see what it's worth. And I'm about to head off. Ooh, the hot. It was sitting in the sun. Cast on. I moseyed on up to go see Dennis at Barnyard Antiques. Hey, Kenny, is that you? What up with you, man? Did this dude just come out of the toilet? This is heavy leather. Nice tooling. A uh, 45, four-inch barrel would fit in there real nice. I have an idea this was made in Colorado. How you know it was made in Colorado? Uh, yeah, here, look, here's something in here. It says H.H. H. Heiser, made in Denver, Colorado. <laughs> What do you got on here? I don't know. I see something here. This looks like a doorstop. It's beautiful, though. Yeah. 1930. It's got all the original uh, paint on it. It's a prairie wagon. Little house on the prairie. Little house on the prairie. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so tell me about this right here, Dennis. OK. That's an ox yoke. This dropped down over the top of their head. You hooked your wagon down here to this. Oh, all right. Nice piece. So tell me how much for the whole cowboy starter kit right here. Well, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. All right, now that's what we're talking about right here. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Here, Benjamin talking. About fourteen hundred dollars. You got yourself a deal there, sir. Pew, pew, promenade. I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world!